Namibia partially lifts movement restrictions of animals in Zambezi region. Namibia has partially lifted the restrictions on the movement of cloven hoofed animals and animal products in the Zambezi region, which were imposed after detecting a foot and mouth disease FMD, outbreak in cattle on October 13. Namibia's Directorate of Veterinary Services, DVS, and the Ministry of Agriculture, Water and Land Reform, MAWLR, in a statement Sunday, said that the first round of cattle vaccination against FMD has so far been completed in crush pen areas that are within the 30-kilometer radius from Balasant and Kasika of Zambezi region, with 48,458 out of 52,480 cattle vaccinated, with SAT trivalent vaccine, representing vaccination coverage of 93.3%. To stay up to date with latest top stories, make sure to subscribe to this YouTube channel by clicking the button above this video. Since the infection is still in the eastern part of the region in Cab South constituency, the infected area is the Kralls and Balasant and Kasika villages, while the new disease management area, DMA, is, therefore, Cab South constituency, the country's chief veterinary officer Albertina Shilongo said. According to Shilongo movement restrictions of all cloven hoofed animals and animal products from the DMA to the rest of the region will stay in place. Several patrol teams are strategically placed, and the public is urged to cooperate with the veterinary and police officials fully. Revaccination of all cattle in the region will continue, and all farmers are strongly urged to bring their cattle for vaccination to the designated crush pens, as per announcement by DVS officials, she said, highlighting the measures which are still in place. Shilongo meanwhile, said movement of all cloven-hoofed animals among crush pens in Cab South constituency in the DMA is allowed, but not to the rest of the region, while slaughtering of fully vaccinated cloven-hoofed animals for own consumption within the DMA is also allowed. Farmers and the general public are now once again requested to report to the relevant authorities any suspicious cases of FMD as well as the suspected illegal movement of animals and their products, as prohibited in the public notification, she concluded. FMD clinical signs in cattle include salivation, not grazing, limping, reluctance to move, fever, blisters, and ulcers on the tongue, gum, and on hooves.